and I call the member for Durack. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. I'm pleased to speak to the House today to launch my latest campaign. Hey, Durack, where is your mobile black spot? And as I'm sure some of my colleagues are very tired of hearing that, I've said it numerous times before, Durack is indeed a very unique and very vast electorate, spanning over 1.5 million square kilometres. It is the largest electorate in the continent and the second largest in the world. Each portfolio of the federal government, of course, is important to Durack, health, education, agriculture, but telecommunications coverage is one common problem which my constituents all talk to me about. From as far north as Wyndham in the Kimberley, out to Walloona in the Midwest, and as far east as Meriden in the Wheatbelt. Mobile reception is also an issue which impacts each sector. Hospitals, healthcare, primary, secondary schooling, education, and businesses of all shapes and sizes. Madam Deputy Speaker, as you can see, mobile reception is greatly important in my electorate. The Turnbull government and I understand that that is why I'm pleased to launch my latest campaign. Say it again. Hey, Durack, where is your mobile black spot? This will be my campaign to improve telecommunications across Durack. Once we ascertain what towns in Durack urgently need improved coverage, there's no doubt that the newly elected Minister for Communications will have me in his ear on a non-stop basis. My intention is not to stop until all the towns in my electorate of Durack have a similar level of basic communications infrastructure which are enjoyed by their city cousins. Mobile telephone reception is having a negative impact on the backbone of both Durack's economy and also the Australian's economy, and we know that to be small business, and I include all those people on the land who make a living. This issue is quite prevalent among the thousands of farmers in my electorate, and as more and more farmers are using technologies of various descriptions, it's becoming an increasing problem. At each of the regional shows I attended in the last few weeks, in Darren, Mullawa, Chapman Valley, Mingan UX Boat, and also the Mora Show, farmers from right across Durack throughout the wheat belt and the Midwest raised the issue of poor coverage with me and explained how it is impacting their business and their families. Its negative impact on small businesses is preventing them from reaching their full potential and it is impacting their bottom line. Both farmers and small business owners are having their productivity reduced because of a lack of reception. And as you know, Deputy Madam Speaker, what is bad for business is bad for jobs and this is another reason why I'm launching this campaign. This issue is so deep and it is impacting what I consider to be a basic Australian right, and that's a student's ability to access education. It too was a major theme at the Mora Higher Education Forum, which I hosted in August together with Senator Mackenzie. This campaign will improve something which those in the House will know that I am passionate about, which is education across all levels. With improved reception, students will have greater access to education options and be able to access something which many in the city just take for granted, which is quality internet reception. This will assist regional students of all levels, primary, secondary and higher education with such things like research and their assignments, etc. Now, Deputy Madam Speaker, this is a modern day issue and I'm going to work very hard to improve reception across all levels in the electorate of Durack. Since the government and myself were elected just over two years ago, we have made huge improvements in telecommunications access in reception in Durack. In June this year, in Western Australia, we delivered over 41.3 million worth of reception improvements under round one of the mobile black spot program. Over 10.4 million was from the federal government. Under this round, we're delivering 45 new or upgraded base <coughs> stations, which will address 123 black spots as reported to my constituents. At the regional shows I attended, constituents from all walks of life thanked me for delivering improved reception through round one of the mobile black spot program, as we announced in June. Madam Deputy Speaker, I'm very pleased to declare, hey, Durack, where is your mobile black spot campaign now open?